As a result, if one or both of your kidneys stops functioning, it's a sign that it they held on for as long as it they could and just couldn't go on any longer. Which is why kidney failure is as serious as it is. That said, while our kidneys are resilient through most things, their work could become substandard when they're not at their best. This drop in performance might not be immediately evident, but if we pay attention to certain things, we could tell whether or not our kidneys are dying. Before we get into all that, though, let's quickly look at what exactly our kidneys do. In every human being, the kidneys come in a pair, one on either side of the spine. As you probably already know, the primary function of the kidneys is to filter your blood and remove waste products, which are actually toxins. These waste products are then transported to the bladder to be passed out as urine. Following from this, we can see how important the kidneys are in the production of urine. Just to further drive home the point, think about how many times you urinate every day and then factor in the fact that you only urinate when your bladder is somewhat full and not necessarily when there is a drop of urine in it. Now you probably have an idea of how hard your kidneys work. However, that's not all. Because of the function of your kidneys, you can eat a variety of foods and drinks and even take in your doctor prescribed medications without having to bother about the buildup of toxins in your body because your kidneys are there for you. Which is why dying kidneys can spell a lot of terrible things for the human body, chief of all being a buildup of toxins. That said, what exactly could make the kidneys fail? Are they susceptible to wear and tear? Thankfully, the kidneys are not susceptible to wear and tear. Like most parts of the body, your kidneys should be able to do their work fine regardless of how long they work. However, there are conditions that could cause them to break down. Probably the major causes of kidney diseases are other diseases, chief of them being high blood pressure and diabetes 1 and 2. The reason is that your kidneys have some tiny blood vessels in them. High blood pressure or high sugar levels could cause these vessels to get clogged, thereby affecting the ability of the kidneys. Other medical conditions that can cause damage to the kidneys include an HIV infection, sickle cell disease, certain cancers, and even a direct infection of the kidneys themselves. That said, other medical conditions are not the only things that can cause the kidneys to break down. Severe dehydration can also do this. In addition, anything that obstructs the flow of urine from the kidneys to the bladder could also obviously restrict the ability of the kidneys. This anything could be kidney stones, an enlarged prostate, or strictures. Being exposed to certain toxic, biologically toxic, that is, environments could also put you at risk of having dying kidneys. Same as taking certain medications, which is why you should only take doctor-prescribed medications.